Hey guys, Arcane Venom here, and welcome your faces back to another Warlords of Draenor expansion playthrough with my level 92 hunter, Benicius. Now, we left off here having to talk to, what's your name? Burian Colpart. Now, we will talk to him in a second. Um, I just wanted to say a few things first. Number one, I love your faces a lot. Um, and number two, I've decided not to use a webcam for this particular series because I feel like it will ruin the immersion. I kind of want to play through the the character of Benicius on this particular series. If you want to see a webcam, let me know in the comments below. I really want to know about your opinion. If we go onto the map, I've just realized that we didn't hand in the two quests from the last video, so we will try to do that today at some stage. One thing I also wanted to put across is a lot of people wanted me to go back to Shadow Moon because I didn't actually fulfill and complete the entire story uh, to Shadow Moon Valley. So yeah, we got sidetracked and we didn't actually complete the whole Shadow Moon thing. Uh, my apologies, we will go back there even if the XP is isn't that great just to complete the law uh, so let's talk to Burry and Colpart here and let's begin the quest line someone wanted me to uh, speak Scottish um, which I, I I really don't want to do um, I, I'll give it a shot hold on hold on I cannot believe them but I, I I literally I don't okay I'm not gonna do an accent for that anymore in fact I don't think I'm actually gonna read it uh, so there's two quests available uh, from Burry and Colpart okay so the quest objective here is to burn six mulching bodies now I really don't know what what that is. These Batani got a few corpses lying around that I saw. Might be a good idea to burn these bodies. So basically, I just need to clear up all the dead. And I get 21,150 XP for that. So we'll accept that quest. Um, and the next quest is a green Oregon. Um, what the frick is this thing? So we'll go and do that. So whereabouts are these guys located? They seem to be in the same area by the looks of things, which is great. So let's go about and do that now. Ooh, look, there's a dead body literally right outside the door. That's generally depressing. Okay, so we need to find five more bodies, and I've realized now that we can't tame these little critters. Um, I didn't know. I, someone told me you could tame a squirrel. Apparently that's now false. Let's burn this body. This is really graphic. In fact, this guy is literally your twin. Look at him. He's wearing the exact same thing as you. Okay, right, let's find more bodies, um, and let's go in the general direction of where this ogre thing is. I'm guessing, oh, Ogron? I think it's an Ogron. I don't know why I want to call it an ogre. It's a, it's a one-eyed beast. Oh, there it is. That thing is freaking humongous. Is there a body around here? Can I burn that? Oh, fair enough. I can just burn everything. Okay, I tell you what we'll do. We will actually take this guy on now, uh, and then we'll find the dead bodies later. So let's just hop across these real quick. Hopefully my computer won't lag too much. My computer's having a bit of a weird day today. Let's take this son of a bitch on, okay? Let's see what he drops. There's a dead body there. There's a few dead bodies. I see there's two there, I think, on the floor near him. He doesn't seem like he's too OP. I just want to see if I can get a kill shot on him if possible. Is he regenerating? I have to still look at my attacks sometimes. And so when I look down and I look back up, I'm like, you definitely had way more health than you did beforehand. Right, we've got him real low now. Kill shot. Can we get a kill shot on him? There we go. Sweet. Right. Oh, shit. Wow, he doesn't even carry anything. Never mind. We've got a few dead bodies here that we can burn. Um, again, that's somewhat good, I think. Just casually burning a few dwarfs. So how many more do we need? We just need one more body. Right, let's swim to the other side real quick to see if we can find another dead body. There's one right there, conveniently placed next to this big silent watcher. Isn't that so convenient, Blizzard? Right, let's take this guy on real quick. This is it. This is the last corpse we needed to burn. So those two are all done. We can hand it in because he's been following us the the whole time. So that's like 40,000 XP just there and then. Um, complete that quest and the next one. Oh, we are so close to level 93. Will we actually hit it? Oh, no, no. I think it's like one more quest, uh, which actually we can do right now. So we've got a coal parts revenge. I'm not so full. I can't swing an axe even if I had one. Um, I, we've got a few mutual interests here. Blah, blah, blah. Slay three Jew masters and 21,150 XP. I think that will be enough XP to push me over the line and to get to level 93 in this video. So let's Let's accept that quest. Um, we've also got some uh, quests to actually hand in. Okay, guys, so we're going to hand in the quests from the last video because I believe that will literally bring us over to level 93 real quick. So let's talk to Uriel. We get that beastie ring as well. So that's 21,150 XP. I'm pretty damn sure that I'm going to see us level up when I click accept this quest. Here we go. Yes! <laughs> Level 93, that's freaking amazing. Uh, we are getting closer and closer to level 100. I really thought that this series will last forever. Um, obviously, it's going to last a lot longer yet, and I believe it will probably last throughout this entire year. Um, but at least we've actually gone through 
uh, the whole process. And a lot of people want me to level up from 1 uh, all the way to 100 as well at some stage, which I might possibly do. Um, but I guess I have played my mage from level 1 to level 24, so I kind of know the early stages. I just don't know the in-between stages of leveling a character. Uh, but if you guys really want to see a level 1 to 100 playthrough, I might invest in it once we get Vinicius to level 100. I don't think it's going to be much of a threat having more online people around us killing them as well. Here we go. This is the last one, and I'm going to give my computer a, a fresh reboot as well because it is slow as fuck. Um, there is a rare mob over here though. I'm really interested in getting to that rare mob if I can. Oh wow, let's take it on. It's a raptor. What a weird place to have a dinosaur. Okay, so this is crazy. It doesn't dish out that much damage, but it just looks aggressive. It looks pretty darn cool though. Uh, we've seen a lot of rare mobs around here. I know they're not that rare and I know they respawn really damn quickly, but it's still interesting to come across one and I still like to hunt them down. I am a hunter after all um, and I just like seeing them as well. It's nice having a game with so many models and so many different things that you can explore and find. Ooh, what is that? Is it a dagger? How much gold is it worth? 37 gold, level 539. So it's not really the highest of levels. That's not bad though. I don't really kill these. I mean, I do kill these for the loot. It's kind of for the loot as well. Right, let's hand in this quest. What are you doing? Baryon, what are you doing? Okay, let's just let's just hand in this quest before this gets awkward. Okay, let's complete the quest. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. Thank you very much for watching. It's been Arcane Venom. We've burnt loads of dwarfs. We've killed a massive Ogron thing. It's been a generally interesting experience all around. So anyway, guys, I will see you in the next video. And as always, see you in the next one.